Hey kids, what's up? It's Coach Sloth here, and I'm having a great time with my son, Elliot. And Everett, he's around here someplace, I don't know where he's at. But Elliot, want to say hi to the kids? Hi. And he's almost ready to go to school here. How old are you? How old are you? Four. He's four years old, so maybe next year he can go join some of you kids at kindergarten. So, But today we're, uh, we're just hanging out, chilling. I thought I might read a couple stories. So... When I, I'm, I tell you what, I'm really fired up. I can't wait to come to school and talk to everybody. And I've had a great time the last couple months. And it's just great to be back speaking to kids again. And so what I'll tell you kids is a little bit about how I became an author and read a couple of my stories. And then I will encourage you kids to write your own stories. You kids are always doing all kinds of crazy fun things, going on trips, probably went someplace on spring break and, and or over Christmas or or you do fun things at school, ball games, you're, you're always up to something fun. Write stories about that. And I give that assignment for you kids to write stories about some of the fun things you do. And I've been giving the assignment for quite some time, and I got a few stories back this last week. So I thought, you know what, I, start make, start, I should start making some videos when I read the stories from the kids. And the first one I got uh, this last week, I'll just read this one right here. It's called Hallie the Horse, Me the Sport. You see that, all right? And it's by Adeline. Yeah, it's pretty good. She did all the illustrations. She stapled it together. It's pretty awesome. Here we go. One day, Hallie the horse wanted to do a sport. Mrs. Horse said to try s swimming, but Hallie could not float, so she tried basketball. But she was too small. Down to do a little swimming, oh playing a little basketball. Let's see that? Come over here. Do a little basketball. So then she tried ping pong, but she could not hold the paddle up. She played against Dan the Cow. There's Dan the Cow. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I got Everett the Cow over there. You hear him mooing? Yeah, there's an off button. Yep, sweet. And then she tried track. I'm not pushing, I'm, I'm not tapping the off button. She tried track, and, and what did you know? She was great at it. She beat Shelby the Sloth. Max the Moose, and Izzy the Lizard. There she is, those sloths are not very fast. Yeah, it looks like she's good at running. Hallie became a superstar all around the world. She won a trophy, she's got her name in the paper. So that's pretty awesome, I love the illustration. Yeah, she probably won the Kentucky Derby, probably won the Preakness, went on to win the Belmont Stakes, won the whole Triple Crown. She's like a world famous horse now, so I have to keep an eye next time I head to the tracks and keep my eye out for Hallie the Horse. That's kind of cool. This is an awesome book. I love it. And there it is. Hallie the Horse Need a Sport. I love it. That, that gets me inspired to write some more stories. I can't wait. Maybe I'll have to put Hallie the Horse in my next book. And I got a whole bunch more. And my next video that I'm going to read is Sammy's Big Race. I got a whole bunch more. And kids, keep coming, keep giving me your stories. I'll share them on my videos here, and because it gets me inspired to write more books, and I can't wait. I get more ideas. You kids come up with all kinds of crazy ideas. You give me ideas, so I can't wait. So I appreciate that. So I got some. Oh, I need to read about the author too. And it's uh, I am seven, and my birthday is March 18th. Happy birthday! It's coming up here, and uh, Coach Law, thank you for reading your book. So that's awesome. So I really appreciate that. Thank you, Hallie. And uh, kids, keep sending your stories when I come visit or mail them to me, and I'll read your books on my videos. So I love it. All right. We'll take, talk to you later.